Well, it's November 11th, which is Veterans Day. It's a day to honor the servicemen and women who fought in wars of past and present. From parades to ceremonies, the Mid-South showing respect to the people protecting our country. Good evening and thank you for joining us. I'm Pepper Baker. Now down in Hernando, Mississippi, the city hosted a Veterans Day parade and our videographer captured the sights, sounds and scenes of the tribute to our veterans. Let's go veterans, let's go. It's so nice to see the schools here and all the kids and they're all waving flags and some places that's not taught anymore. Just to see the, um, the support that the community gives as far as um, reaching out, just letting our veterans know that we appreciate their service, their sacrifice, and not only just that, you know, their families that are behind um, supporting them as well. I am very appreciative of all veterans, the sacrifices that they've made uh, for our freedoms here in America. I feel like it is important for us to be here to honor those who have served. For instance, this little guy, his dad served in the Iraq War as well. Quite a good showing there. And back here in Memphis, a good turnout for the ceremony at the West Tennessee Veterans Cemetery earlier this afternoon. Flags were placed on every veteran's grave. Bird dogs and steermen did a flyover. Now the Craigmont High JROTC did a posting and retiring of colors. And the Germantown Police Honor Guard did the 21 gun salute. Tommy Baker, the commissioner of the Tennessee Department of Veterans Services, explains why celebrating Veterans Day is so important. I think it's important, for one, that we recognize the service and sacrifice. I think it's also important that we teach our younger generation that this is important, that, uh, you know, the freedoms we have and enjoy as Americans, they, uh, they're not granted to each generation. We all have to stand up and defend them. All across the nation, people honored veterans with different parades and ceremonies.